Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Cookie Run Tower of Adventures with Alzroy Calcone. And in this episode I'm going to show you my experience fighting the latest raid boss which is going to be Lemon. What, what is Lemon? Lemon? I don't know. Whatever would you like to spell this particular boss name. Anyway, if you like this kind of content then be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe and don't forget to ring the bell so you won't miss out anything that I put on this channel. Everything is free, you don't need to pay, and by subscribing you make this channel grow and flourish even more, which makes me happy so I can create more content for you to watch. Hmm, this is strange. Usually matchmaking isn't taking as long as this. Eventually, after some more waiting, I've got into a match, finally. <laughs> So, Lemon, this boss fight, in terms of difficulty, in my opinion, it's actually quite hard. And by that, I mean it has the same difficulty like Florets did in the video that I did on the raid mode against that particular boss fight. Oh, it looks like that there's only three people that are going to fight against this particular boss. Hopefully that doesn't increase the difficulty or something. Anyway, I'm playing in the level 4 difficulty and because I'm playing in the level 4 difficulty, that meant the chaining rule is back, just like in the previous video when I'm fighting against Sham Monkey. Oh, it looks like the second player who made Crush Pepper Cookie just like I am got disconnected. Oh, that's bad, the game decides to chain me with the disconnected Crush Pepper Cookie player, so that's not good. That's the worst possible outcome. <laughs> and just take a look at the damage that caused by me not getting close enough to that player who got disconnected. At the start, I have around 12,000 hit points and now I have 8.9 thousand by the end of the chaining section. So yeah, that, that's just to show you we need to stick together and hopefully the game doesn't decide to chain you to a player who gone AFK. <laughs> One thing that I do notice about Lehman in both the raid mode as well as the main story mode is that this boss likes to stay in a corner. Is it just me or does everyone experience the same thing like I did? Anyway, leave your experience fighting against this boss fight in the comment section down below. I would love to hear your opinion about this boss. Anyway, back to the battle at hand where my health is now at around 5000 because the game decided to lick me up again with the guy who got AFK'd. <laughs> Choose someone else game, not me. Look, I know I'm the tanker, I'm supposed to take the hit. I don't know, it felt pretty cheap to have me stuck with the guy who got afk and the boss is in the other side of the map and you cannot damage the boss. Oh yes, yes, a little bit of a disclaimer, this is the first fight that I ever did against this particular boss in this particular game mode. I mean look at this, I have around 12,000 hit points when I start this raid and now I only have 4,500 and I'm pretty sure those damage taken was because I'm staying too far from my chain teammate, even though the chain teammate is now afk <laughs> I don't know how many times I've said that in this particular boss fight, in this particular run. I've now talked like a broken clock at this point. <laughs> anyway, back to the fight itself where I discovered that I'm about to end this fight quite soon. So a little bit of touch in there, and this should do it. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. Finally, the job is done. <laughs> Hopefully the next fight and the subsequent one will bring me a better experience. So let's see if the Coco Fairy comes around and no, that's not to be the case. But despite that, I still got some materials to create equipment, <laughs> a super epic one. So with this fight over, let me introduce you to the next scheduling. So the schedule is going to be, I'll come back to Cookie Con Oven Break and do a video on Cream Soda Cookies trial in both the normal difficulty as well as in the rainbow difficulty. 
and afterwards it is going to be the brand new cookie trial that belongs to this cake cookie. Anyway, after I spent more time waiting I finally got a matchmaking. And hopefully this time around there won't be any players that goes AFK. <laughs> Oh yes, where was I earlier? Oh yes, the scheduling. So right after those two videos about the cookie trials on cream soda cookie and cheesecake cookie, I've got a little bit of surprise for you. So what is the surprise it is going to be? Well, I can't tell you right now, so... But rest assured that this... Well, you will be seeing this on the channel. Anyway, I'm going to stay silent for now because I have nothing left to say at the moment. So enjoy the rest of the gameplay video until I found something interesting to talk about. <laughs> Right, time to see the rewards and oh, oh you're not giving me the golden chest award I guess game? Because there's a reward for that. <laughs> well, maybe next time. Anyway, it's time to move on into the next battle. And once again, I'm going to use crushed pepper cookies simply because the sting durian, which is one of the alternative for this boss fight is, well, the ones I have isn't strong enough to fight this particular boss. Oh, this this is something interesting. <laughs> I don't know that the matchmaking can do this. <laughs> There's only two players around. <laughs> there was even one case of me fighting alone. <laughs> Too bad I don't record that though. <laughs> but spoiler alert, I did actually beat the boss by myself. <laughs> So yeah, final top tip before I end this narration part of this video. If you see the raid mode timer goes beyond 40 seconds, cancel it and start in your 
because it will be better than whatever this is. <laughs> anyway, that's it for today. I'm Alfred Galcon, signing it off, and I'll see you on the next video. Take care, stay safe, and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now, everyone. Okay, let's see if I got blessed by the fairy. Come on, C Coco fairy, come to me and... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Why? Why? Oh, he got the... <laughs> he got the unique weapon for Ginger Brave. <laughs> oh, well. Maybe next time.